What is happening, people? Hey, guys. We're back at Heiko Lake to get today. Uh, water temperature's done dropped to about 71 degrees, which is good for the crappie. Still not quite low enough yet for those crappie to make that transition into their winter pattern. Uh, anyway, today we got Carolina all out. Uh, Chris, Douglas, and Josh is going to be filming today. They're coming down, and they wanted to come down, and they wanted to fish Heiko Lake and uh, kind of see what's going on and kind of promote the lake uh, within the show. And as you remember, we went fishing with these guys, uh, white bass fishing on the Falls uh, Eno River not too long ago. So today I'll be filming intermediately and uh, we're gonna do a catch and cook today. We're gonna keep some crappy and we're gonna cook them later. We're gonna do a mustard based crappy. So uh, I'll show that a little later. And uh, anyway, we're gonna be doing some vertical jigging. We're gonna fish some docks. Hey, we're gonna do anything I can do to put these guys on some fish. So hey guys, stay tuned and let's go catch a fish. Probably hit the tree. Oh, is that what it is? You good? Yeah, you were. You went right in the fish. Let's see. Well, you should be right there. Like getting your control right there. No, you all right? Just work you lower. You should. You should be. That's you right there. Dry, lower your rod tip. A little bit. You in the fish right there? One's right there, right on yours too. See that fish right there? He's on your lower right there. He just went back. Oh, that's a good one right there. Damn. Oh, nice. I'm gonna get you right back up here. You see how quick we drifted off of that? Yeah, that wind's picked up a little bit. Well, <clears throat> actually, that helps the fishing. All right, I'm gonna let it go right there, five foot. Here you go. Another decent crappy. Another decent crappy on the spoon, y'all. Boom. Pretty crappy. Ready to go. <laughs> I think we shot on past it, went on by. Well, that's why I moved it over there. So oh, you, you keep wanted us... me to do it. Yeah, okay, I said that. Yeah, that way you put okay, your foot. Okay, I can keep it on That's there. all right. All yeah. right, we got it now. Uh, <clears throat> tell you what, if we drop, if we drop right there, it's gonna push us back past it. We'll just drop right in there. <clears throat> if you want to pick up, drop right back in there, Chris. Uh -huh. Pick it up, drop it right back in there. We're five feet straight in front of where that arrow is there. All right. All right, you drop it right down on top of it. All right, there you go, right there. Let it go, let it go, let it go, let it go, let it go. Right, you in the fish there. You should get bit. I see them swiping this. Yeah, they, they bumped it, didn't they? Something going on down there. You jigging there. it? Ooh, but, pulled too fast. Oh, 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 let it go. There it yeah. goes back. Down, down, down. Right, jigging. you in them right there. Just twitch it, just barely twitch it. And sometimes you can just dead stick it. Fish up around the top. Man. Yep. You see how we've been fishing this, how they've been moving around on the structure. Mm -hmm. Still nothing. Right 
front, like 10 foot. So that's me. That should be. Oh, I think I just got hit. Yep. Yeah, you got it. Boom. Yep. Good job. Yep. There you go. I was looking down there and they're, they're jumping on these things. <laughs> he's awful small, isn't he? Yeah, he's a little small. We can throw him back. I there think you go. I think this one might be I a key. Oh yeah. All right, right on it. All right, right. It's it's basically dead on the screen. There you, go, there you go, down, down, lower it on down. Can you go a little more? You got some fish coming over there. Boom. Oh, and that's a better feeling fish bro show. <laughs> oh yeah, good crap. Yeah. Good crap. Good crap. So sometimes, sometimes uh, there you go, Sam. Some, sometimes uh, sometimes they thump it pretty, pretty, pretty good. Yeah. And sometimes, let's see, hold on a minute, Chris. Before you swing it out, let me let me get you right. That's right. That's right. I'm saying. No, it was five, ten feet out. Straight out in front of that arrow. That's pretty cool. <laughs> you just got to get around it just right. Another one come up, hit it three times. Boom. There he is. There he is. Just like that. Yep. I tell you what, it's all about being in the right the right position on these guys. Sun's starting to come out. Is that going to cause us a problem? No, they might go a little deeper. You noticed on that brush how they've gotten down about yeah, 12 to 15 feet. They've moved down that brush a little bit. But no, it shouldn't bother us too bad. Good. Now you said you've got some other places. I mean, this one's doing great, but you oh, yeah. got some other places you want to... Yeah, are you ready to go try them? Yeah. He's okay. a little small. I believe I'll just turn in. Okay, yeah, we've got yeah. some good quality crap in there. Yeah, we yeah. sure do. We sure do. All right, so headed to the next next place and going to try to see what uh, how these guys are as aggressive these, as the ones we're catching right now, huh? Yep, we'll go check them out, and uh, these... These fish have been bit, biting pretty good, so we'll check that other place out and see if we can get them to bite and cooperate. Sounds good, Sam. Vertical jigging with the curly tail. You see? Oh yeah, sometimes you just let it straight. See this group right here? 15 foot out in yep. front of us. See that big group? Yeah. Uh, move. Got him? Yep. Oh, got off. You held on to your Man. About the same size, right, didn't we you? had about a we had a double going on yeah, there for a sure second. Did. I do I do want to have some fryers. My grandmother's a really big fan of crappy on this one. Do her up some. Whole fish? Yeah, some whole ones. She likes those. Well I'll fry some of them too. I'll fillet fish till you, like we got a mess. you tell me to stop. <laughs> so we just pull it. 11 inch crappy. I don't know how many we had, but we probably had close to our limit. Yeah, I was.
I got Boone to make you something. Oh, yeah? Yep. I, I got him to make you a knife. Oh, you kidding me? Yep. Oh, yeah. Look at there. Yeah. How about that? Check this thing out. Oh, my goodness. Boom. Yeah, he, he does a really good job, knives. I, I task wow. him with making you a knife. Wow. Look at that. Uh, Ain't that something? Yeah. How about that? Carolina man? All Out. And just to appreciate all the work that y'all do, you know, spreading the good word about. All the opportunities for hunting and fishing in the state of North Carolina. We we have some great opportunities. I tell you what. Yeah. Look at all that you do and letting everybody know what you uh, what they have to offer and telling them how. I just kind of entertain everybody, but you tell them how <laughs> to get it done. So that's awesome. Wow, isn't this amazing here? I mean, the leather work. Look at that handle. I mean, everything. That's I mean, that's perfect. Got the gut hook on it. That'll go. That'll be working on the deer here pretty soon. Yeah, we we want to. Yeah, we want to see that gutting up. Yeah, gut we'll, deer. we'll definitely do that. That's a, what a craftsman Boone is there. I have to shake Boone's hand for sure there. How long has he been doing it? How long have you been doing it, Boone? How long have you been doing it? Come up this here. This type of work. Almost two years. Mm, Almost two, two years, years. Yeah. Man, do you work in Damascus and all that other stuff, or just a little bit? Yeah. Oh yeah. No, I ain't even got to see I it think yet. That's beautiful. Look at that thing. Yeah, that's, uh, that's called AEBL stainless steel. Um, very similar to like Buck Knives 440C. Yeah. Um, puts a little bit of sharper edge on it. This is the first gut hook he's made. Very and cool. He did a really good job on it. I love the leather work. Oh, I know. Yeah. Look at that. I'm that's starting to awesome. try to do the leather bracelets because he, I like the leather. That is something else, man. I, I so guys, we're getting ready to end this video. Sorry, I didn't end the video at the lake. Uh, after we ate, we had a lot of stuff to put up and clean up, and it kind of slipped my mind. But all in all, we had a fantastic day fishing with Carolina All Out, and we always enjoy going fishing with those guys. Hey, check those guys out. They're on YouTube as well, Carolina All Out. They're also on Spectrum TV. If you have Spectrum, you can check those guys out. And uh, we gave away that knife. We appreciate Chris and all he does and sharing the opportunities in the state of North Carolina with the people. And so I had Boone to make that knife. And uh, I think he was really surprised. It seemed like it anyway. And anyway, hey guys, fall fishing is heating up. These colder temperatures are gonna put these crappie on the move and we're gonna start catching some really nice crappie here really, really soon. So stay tuned for that. We've got a couple of deer hunting trips coming up. Uh, that we're going to do. we got some fall crappy trips to do to so some of my favorite places to fish in the fall. And uh, hey, don't forget to hit that subscribe button below. Subscribe to the channel. Click the like button. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss an episode of Wildlife Adventures. And as always, you remember, it's a wild life and I'll see you on the water.